When it's done, this will be a portrait of Mario Draghi, the man who may very well be Italy's next president. The 74-year-old technocrat who headed the European Central Bank and is currently serving as prime minister. He's widely liked abroad and here at home. He is a very serious person and knows what he is doing. He's authoritative. He has the skills recognized at European and world level. For us, he's perfect. But it's political interests and not public popularity that will decide Draghi's fate. Choosing the head of state is the job of lawmakers, just over a thousand of them from across the country. These great electors, as they are known here, are from all sides of the political spectrum. This is the Quirinale Palace, the president's office in Rome. One analyst put it to me this way, if Mario Draghi doesn't get elected as president, it will most likely be because political parties cannot agree on what happens after he leaves his office as prime minister. As Prime Minister, Mario Draghi has brought much-needed stability to Italy's chaotic politics, where governments here often collapse after just one year. His departure from the Premiership could plunge the country into political crisis, especially if it triggers an early election. There are two scenarios in, in the case of Draghi's election as a president of the Republic. Uh, the first one is that uh, there's an agreement between the political forces that are composing his majority to set up another government. This is the best case scenario. The other scenario is the election of Draghi, but there's not uh, a cooperation among political parties. Very difficult to set up another government. Uh, and in this case, Draghi, as president of the Republic, in front of chaos, might decide to dissolve the parliament and come in back to vote. I think the first scenario is more likely, but we cannot uh, exclude the second one. All eyes will be here on parliament this week, where secret ballots will be cast in person under COVID protocols. The artist only needed a few minutes to finish his portrait, but it's going to be at least a few days before Italians know if Mario Draghi will indeed be their next president.